Hi guys, happy Monday. Welcome back to the weekly vlog. If you're new here, please subscribe, give us a like and a comment. And if you're one of our loyals, welcome back. So last week you saw that I was going through my clothes and putting them up on Poshmark to sell. Well, that was on Sunday, today is Monday. So one day later and I've sold three of my items. These two things are something I'm sending uh, to my friends so those don't count but yeah and these priority mail boxes are stuff that I sold from Poshmark so I sold a denim jacket a tie-dye shirt and a camo sweater so I'm excited I'm making good sales hi you guys it's Megan I feel like I'm about to sneeze I was just putting pepper in the mushrooms and we're having oh god um, we're having spaghetti tonight so I'm sauteing mushrooms I have some Badia Complete Seasoning salt and pepper in here. And this is butter and olive oil. This is a mix of sausage and ground turkey. And then we're keeping it real simple with some four cheese sauce and this fresh mushroom sauce. And then we have spaghetti. I'm gonna season it up, of course. I have some oregano, some complete seasoning, we'll see. And then we're having Sister Schubert's rolls on the side. That's what I'm doing. My sister is in a fire meeting. And my mom just took T and Amaya to cheer. Tegan is already at cheer. So yeah, that's probably gonna be the end of the night. Before. After hey y'all, happy uh, Wednesday. I just left Instacare with Miss Amaya. Um, she jammed her finger on Monday at school and it's super swollen. So I tried to bring her last night, but Instacare closed early. So I brought her today, and luckily it's not broken, there's no fracture, um, it's just sprained really bad. So they gave her a new splint, because I put a splint on it, and wrapped it. Show them your finger. And uh, she has to splint it for two weeks. So I'm gonna go drop her off at school, and then I'm gonna go to the gym. And yeah, that's my day so far. I'm so sad, y'all. I just went and registered Tegan for junior high. <sighs> it's a year away, but I mean, like, they're starting stuff now. Like, I just found out because it's not her boundary junior high. So I didn't get, like, all the normal paperwork you would get at the elementary school when the junior high comes. Found out that um, they have a parent meeting to try out for cheerleading in two weeks. And for some reason, they changed it from when I was in junior high, where seventh grade couldn't try out. And at this school, this is the first year that seventh grade can try out. So a year sooner than what we thought. So I'm gonna have to let her know about that. So I'm sure she'll be excited because we were expecting a whole nother year before uh, school chair. So uh, I'm sad, y'all. Bro, all you wear is Converse. All you wear is confetti shoes. Bro, bro, you literally bought confetti shoes from Ross. <laughs> Um, 
okay. <laughs> I was trying to show you pray these little squishy <laughs> things. <laughs> you recording? And this one, talk about smell. Her chocolate smell like some booty holes. It does. Well, show them what you got. Oh. I'm so playing I mean, at Hershey store. Yeah, from the Hershey store in Vegas. And I guess it smells like booty holes, so. There you smell it. it. Tell me that it smell like booty hole. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> That's weird. That's it smells weird. like mint booty hole. She ain't lying, y'all. She ain't Can't lying. I I sag all the time. So I'm making taco stuffed shells, and Tegan is stirring up the um, stuffing for the shells. Yep, I like cooking. She ain't cooking because I grounded her from her phone for 30 minutes. She ain't got nothing else to do. No. Yeah. Well, I only got grounded from my phone because I told Maya that I won because I got more likes on my TikTok. After I said what? Stop. And she just had to get the last word in. Yeah. So she lost her phone for 30 minutes. Tegan, do not flick it out of that pan. Anyway, that's what we're doing. Making dinner. And everyone else is in the living room and we just went to 7-Eleven. Yes, we went to 7-Eleven and got snacks. Yep, first Sunday. Get, tell everybody how much you spent. Nope. Tell them. Tegan spent seven. No! <laughs> no, I didn't. $17. Mm. Yeah. There's mom. Wait, she has to put her hood on. Okay. Sorry. Oh, I also got snacks for Sunday. For Sunday. And for, because we have this read-a-thon tomorrow. And we can bring snacks and blankets and pillows. And we're going into my old classroom. Because I have to split my class. Because my teacher hasn't been there for, um, like, three months. And so, um, they just said that we're going to split our class. So I'm in this class, named Mr. Walker's class. Yes, I'm only in sixth grade. I don't have like 10 other classes. So, yeah. Is it all melted and combined? Yeah. yeah. You can turn it off. All right, we'll see you guys uh, probably Let tomorrow. Let me stuff the shelves. I record. Okay, all right. Hey guys, so it is Friday and my mom noticed that one of our neighbors back doors has been wide open for a few days and their lights have been on. So I'm going to walk over there and knock on the door and make sure they're not like murdered, you know, and if nobody answers, then I'm going to uh, call the police so they can do like a well check type thing. So yeah, we'll see. So I knocked no answer but i hear i see the dog in there and it was crying and whining it's at the window now i don't want to like look in these people's windows but yeah the lights on lord jesus but then i cannot really see anything the dog started barking so i left but I don't know, should I look in their mailbox, see if they've gotten their mail? <laughs> I'm like, I ain't never dealt with this before. But I think I'm gonna call the police and uh, have them come over and check it out. So update from yesterday, um, the police came, they got into the house, the front door was unlocked. Um, he said that there was no signs of any murder or anything like that. They talked to the neighbor in the front um, of them and they said that they saw somebody leave that morning. But he was like, if you feel like the dogs are being neglected, then I can call the dog people or whatever. But I'm like, who leaves their back door open for a week straight throughout the whole night? Everything leaves all the lights on. Like, something weird going on over there. But yeah, I did my due diligence, so whatever. Hi, you guys. Happy Saturday. So it is 10.36. We are headed to a chair competition, of course. We have one this weekend and then a two-day the one next weekend. Time. Excuse me, sir. A two-day one next weekend and then we're done until April, I believe. So that's what we're doing. Today's only a one day, so we have to be there at noon and awards are at seven. And then after that, we're supposed to go to uh, uh, Texas Roadhouse for dinner. So yeah, that's what we're doing.
driving to Salt Lake. The competition is over. <clears throat> we got a first place, a third place, and a fifth place. You're not in charge. You're not in charge. And it's snowing. Hi, Maya. So now we're on our way to get food. So it's basically a whiteout. That's what we're dealing with. I'm soaked. I stepped in a puddle on the way to the car. Amaya stepped in the puddle. Her feet were sopping wet. Only one of my foot stepped in a puddle. Then we had to go to AutoZone and put some power wings to it. Power wait, steering. Power steering fluid in the red truck, and I'm completely wet. Like I'm a miserably cold. Guys, wet. We just know we did the pink song. It's on the radio. Plan. Anyways, yeah. So I'm. It's it's a whiteout. We did pretty good, guys. I told him. So we're still trucking it along to Texas Roadhouse. I got a salad, ribeye steak, and a baked potato loaded. Mini burgers, loaded mash, chicken fritters, chicken fritters, hot dogs. Thank you. Is everything okay? Okay, so it's Sunday. Happy Sunday. Wait. We just bought egg rolls from Tegan's little boyfriend. Mm -hmm. Yep. And his dad, I guess, makes Piper. <laughs> makes some. Says, thank you for supporting my small business. Egg rolls and Thai sweet chili sauce. So, we're about to try these things. So, sorry. My nose is running. It's cold in here. But, um, update on the egg rolls. They were very good. I was shocked. I ate two of them. I got full. The kids are demolishing them. Um... So yeah, we paid $15 for 12. It's cold in this house. Something is going on with the heat. Um, Cause that freak snowstorm last night, it like dropped the temperatures dramatically or drastically. And so we think that the, the heater kind of flipped out. So I'm buying a space heater for my room because my room always kind of stays cold. So I need to go get that. And then my sister wanted one for her room and then we're getting one for the upstairs, so. We have some space heaters just in case 
this heat decides to play with us. I mean, it's almost spring, but we're gonna have the next couple of, what's on my finger now? I think I got ink on it. Anyway, a couple weeks cold, so who doesn't need a space heater? So we have space heaters to pick up shortly. And that's how we're doing. I'm gonna make a new recipe today called stuffed bell pepper casserole so when i do that i'll show you guys what it looks like okay so um it's um sunday so we're here at the new meal we're making um stuffed pepper casserole and um this will be on the what's for dinner but we just got some meat peppers our seasonings some cheese our broths balsamic vinegar tomatoes and then we're making some cheese bread to go with it, some mozzarella, butter, and pizza crust. Yeah, and there's T. She's helping with dinner. And, yep. And apparently Kraft um, cheese is called Kraft mac and cheese, according to me. So, you'll see that in the what's for dinner, too. So, bye. So, they're measuring out. You need to put a little bit more in there. Three cups of rice. <laughs> and then one flour mixture comes to a boil mm -hmm. we'll add the rice cover and it cooks for 20 to 25 minutes um this will be in the what's for dinner but i'll also put the recipe in the description box of this video down below just in case y'all want to try it and then probably when there's 15 minutes left we'll start the cheese bread we don't have pepper anything all right so we just got the cheese bread ready to go in the oven i'll also link that down below for y'all so you can see it and can I stir this? No. It, you cannot take the lid off. The rice is cooking. So it's juicy. Well, we'll let it keep going, but T Money done cleared off the timer. I'm sorry. Yeah. So <laughs> I just guesstimated, so we'll see. Okay, so me and T um decided last minute to break to, to break to make some brownies. So um we have we got this new thing of brownie mix. I think we got it from Costco. Um, yep. This is the triple... It's the Ghirardelli triple chocolate chunk or something like that. Yeah. And then you're going to need vegetable oil, one-third cup of vegetable oil, one-third cup of water, and then a spatula to get it all out into this. And then I'm using a whisk, and then you need one egg. And so um, once I get it all in the pan and, like, mixed, and before we put it in the oven, I'll show you guys. Okay, so now T's trying to take all the credit, saying that she's trying to stir. But <laughs> um, we have to wait for the garlic bread that's in the oven right now. That is bubbling. Um, bubbling. To pour in our pan. So we, and we just put everything in so it's all stirred. Yes, I stirred the bottom, not like those other people. So <laughs> um, I'll come back when it's poured in the pan. Um, so we just, um, took out the cheese bread from the oven. Yes, it looks bomb. And we just added a bag of cheese in here, and she's gonna try it to see if it needs salt. I showed your face, meme. Um, and, um, um, whatchamacallit. Oh, yeah, I put the brownies in the oven, and they're supposed to go on 325 for salt. 45 minutes. So now we're adding more salt in. I'm gonna put more pepper in. And more pepper so I'll show you when the brownies are done and um, yeah and we are watching crybaby tonight that's why I wanted to make um, brownies my favorite movie eh, eh. okay so now I'm gonna go make me some juice bye so Brent the oh my gosh the brownies are finished um, that is all that's left of that cheese bread and we still have a lot of this. I didn't really like it though. Um, but um, thank you for watching um, our vlog for this week. And um, I hope you enjoyed it. And we'll see you guys next week. Bye.